I hope you enjoyed seeing the and for inquiries about commissions or anything else, then hit me up. Uh, so, <laughs> what? what? So join me and two other YouTubers on a clip to, on a clip to, <laughs> on a clip. Head on over to Wild Horse Brewing, wildhorsebrewingcompany.co.uk, is that the website? The three beers were launched at a special tap house event at Wild Brewing, Wild, Wild, at the Wild, what? Oh, uh, events at Wild Brewing. What? Oh, for f Hello, guys, and welcome back to Cubis Art. Now, recently, I was asked to do a very special commission for Wild Horse Brewing Company, based in Llandidno, North Wales. And what they asked me to do was design some artwork for three limited edition canned beers that they've just released. So this is the biggest commission I've ever done and it was really exciting to see my artwork on three separate beer cans. So join me and two other YouTubers on the trip to Flandidno where we went to a special tap house event for the launch of three new beers from Wild Horse Brewing Company. Let's go. So we are on the way to... Hello. <laughs> so we are on the way to Flandidno for the launch of three limited edition beers at, uh, at the Wild Horse Brewing Company. So yeah, we're gonna go and have a look at the designs, taste the beers, and just have a nice day, basically. Fun. And Organ's very excited. <laughs> Luke's getting excited as well. Just driving. What? Kenin Pedder. Kenin Pedder. Kenin Pedder. Pedder? Pedder? Kenny Pedals. Organ, tell yeah. us a bit about Flanded now. What's special about this town? This town is next to the beach. Mm -hmm. There is uh, um, Alice in Wonderland. Ah, yeah, Alice in yeah. Wonderland. Luke, do you know the link between. Oh, and Flandidno. she was the author was born here or something like that? I think it's. Carol no, I, I think um, Lewis Carroll stayed here on holiday back oh. in the day, and there was this girl. Uh, who also stayed here with her family and uh, I think she was the inspiration for Alice. She went out here once, got a bit mashed. <laughs> she loved the place. Yeah, she did. She, she, had the, she, she went down the road. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she like saw us all some acid tabs and yeah, uh, she, loved the place, she yeah. saw loads of mad shit. <laughs> what else about Clannidna? Um, the great, the great Orm. The Great oh, yeah, Orm. Yeah. Oh, what is it? What kind of town is it? It's like a... A tour, you know, it's a like an old town. holiday location, isn't yeah. it? Like a seaside holiday town with lots of old people live here. Old people singing, retire. old people playing bingo and singing karaoke and yeah. Victorian values. Victorian holiday values. Yeah. <laughs> Over there in the distance is the zoom in a bit, the Great Orm. So you can get a, uh, you can still get, yeah, you can get a tram up to the top. Yeah. There's cable cars. Like yeah, so there's mad goats up on the Great Arm as well. Um, <laughs> mad goats. What is that? Goats. You know what a goat is? Yeah, or she a mad one. Yeah, they're not mad really, they just look mad. They've got huge, huge horns. Welcome to Flandidno, home of an incredibly scary Alice. Interesting architecture. Victorian, is it Victorian? head honcho of Wild Horse Brewing Company, Dave Farragher. So where does the name Wild Horse actually come from? We based the branding on the, the Kenevai ponies. Right. So on the Kenevai mountains. Ah, yeah. So yeah. all our branding is based on the, on the local marvelists. Ah, interesting. Very good. Uh, <laughs> I've forgotten the rest of my questions. <laughs> <laughs> where did the idea come from then to involve a uh, local artist? We were thinking about names of beers and kind of artwork on them and we thought 
getting inspired by things around us is a great start. Um, so the, the, the three that were releasing to, or yesterday, they're all based on things uh, in Plant Didno. We kind of got in touch with Lee and uh, did an amazing job on, on, on the illustrators on the cans. Um, Thank you, <laughs> Absolutely amazing. <laughs> so we're, we're well chuffed with them and um, yeah, uh, yeah, it's perfect really for what we're kind of inspired by it in terms of local things. Yeah, excellent. And what are the three beers? So you've got there's no vacancies, which yep. is yeah. So no vacancies we've got, which is inspired by the guest houses of, of, of Flandidno, mm -hmm. um, and it was a particular one that uh, the drawing's based on, and uh, one of our initial draft customers when we first started. Canary. Um, yeah. is, that, Canary. is that a nickname for the? Uh, he was nicknamed sorry. the Canary uh, <laughs> because and now and again get a problem with the beer, and um, uh, because of the way his setup was, he'd always be the first to phone up with a problem, so he's like the canary. Right, like a canary, canary going down, down into like a gas mine or like yeah. that. <laughs> I see what you mean. Like yeah, yeah. Canary, yeah. And that one's a, um, a so lager. That's a dry hot, uh, yeah. dry hot pills and style lager, yeah. Right, yeah. right. And then moving on to the next one, so you've got Fat Lamp. The Fat Lamp is basically uh, a lamp that they used to use to light the the ancient mines. For example, one of the, one of the ones was the copper mines up there in, on the Great Orm. On the Great Orm, right. Um, the, the beer is kind of hazy, juicy, east coast. New England style pale ale, popped with bits, a bit of secret and mosaic hops. Very nice, very nice. And lastly, you've got tram car. So can you tell us a bit about it behind the, um, so, the sort of imagery on that one? Yeah, so I think that's probably the most obvious one. Tram car. Um, yeah. The, the tram, the tramway in uh, Victorian tramway in Cambridge, mm. um, pretty iconic. We wanted to do something kind of with that, uh, and I think the way that you've done it. It's pretty cool because it's obviously quite a traditional image but yeah i sort of took inspiration from there's a lot of uh, postcards with that pretty much that view yes. of the tramway yeah so i thought that would definitely be the yeah. you know the most iconic yeah. looking angle to get to capture it from and can you just quickly describe the, the beer yeah, yeah the yeah. beer so uh six and a half percent big bold ipa mm -hmm. uh galaxy is the main hop in it uh, also simcoe and columbus in there and uh yeah it's uh, yeah, it's good. And it's very nice. It's my favourite <laughs> one out of the three that I tried today, definitely. What makes your beers special? I mean, for us, it's it's all about quality. You know, everything we do, um, we try to make the beers the absolute best they can be. Yeah. Uh, we're uh, meticulous in uh, everything in terms of from sourcing ingredients, getting the best ingredients we can, right mm -hmm. the way through to the process, right the way through to cleaning and sanitation and make sure it's small. So we just do everything we can to make them as Excellent. good as they can and hopefully uh, people appreciate it. And we do. <laughs> no, they're very good. They're, they taste great. They look great. They're, they're awesome beers. So that's it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed seeing my beer can design journey i can't recommend these beers enough they are all delicious check out wildhorsebrewing.co.uk for more information on the wild horse brewing company and all the beers that they offer they've got some fantastic beers some fantastic products you won't be disappointed go and check them out don't forget to check out my website drcubis.com for merchandise prints and stickers please check out my instagram for more drawings at drcubis and for inquiries about commissions or anything else please check out my facebook page Page, Cubis Design. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you'd like to say something about it, leave it down in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe for more original content from Cubis. See you next time. Bit the top line. Lee Taxi. Not Lee, he doesn't say Lee. Claire. 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 Taxi. Claire, taxi. Yeah, like that. Claire. Claire. Gonna get some fish and chips. Can't come to a seaside town without having fish and chips, really, can we? Unless you Luke Tugwell and you yeah. get ham and cheese nice. toasty. <laughs> yeah. Everyone's got fish and chips. Mm.